in October of 2023, there was an outbreak and a recall. This recall was for onions containing salmonella. Now, remember, October of 2023 was when the initial recall and outbreak started. Now, this is pretty much an update. And at that particular time in October, I had not started bringing to you all the recalls. This is one of the reasons why I started doing the recalls, because I knew you all need to know this information as soon as it becomes available, because they tend to change things. Now, this outbreak was absolutely confirmed. They took samples from water. They took samples from the environment. They took samples from the product. Throughout all of this analysis, it was 100% confirmed that in October of 2023, now this was for chopped onions, but they absolutely contained salmonella. Since that time, there have been 80, 80 reported illnesses. Now we know everybody is not reporting their illness, right? Y'all know that, right? <laughs> okay, so they know of 80 reported illnesses. Now, I'm going to stop right here and take a second because I want to know in the comments how many of you all knew about the outbreak of salmonella in onions and the recall in October of 23. I want to make sure that what I am doing and bringing to you all is current information that you need and can use. And if you did not know about the outbreak of the salmonella in onions in October, Take a second and subscribe to the channel and make sure you turn the notification bell to all so that you can stay informed and up to date. Now, the 80 reports of illnesses was in 23 states. That's half the country. 23 states. Of those 80 illnesses, 18 were hospitalizations and one death. And they have updated and said, oh, it's over. Cancel the recall. Cancel everything. It's over. The last reported illness was November 11th, 2023. Yet now they're saying it's over. Go get your chopped onions. Go eat your chopped onions. It's okay. Is it? If you purchased onions, any chopped onions during that time, you can find those in the freezer section. You can also find those in the refrigeration section, like your produce section. You can find chopped onions in both of those places. Please don't consume them. Please go get an onion yourself, a whole onion, and chop it up. You don't have to buy chopped onions and get a chopper if you can't chop it by hand. They have officially, as of December 4th, stated that the outbreak is over. It's fine. Go eat your onions. I would still advise you to be aware. And if you have bought chopped onions, if they are in your freezer from back in October or even through November, to please discard them. It is not worth the risk. Today is December 14th, 2023. Don't forget to leave me the comments to let me know if you, you knew about that recall and the salmonella poisoning in onions.